Welcome to WTO Well 11 Your Day. I'm Steven Jackson in for Amanda Faye and uh, a lot of folks have the day off, but we're keeping you uh, on time and letting you know everything you need to know about the weather. So let's get things over to First Alert Meteorologist Diane Phillips. So good morning to you, Diane. Good morning, Stephen. You uh, have been giving us traffic updates all along and the best thing you said this morning was that construction season is slowly winding down. Yeah, it is, but that means the fall, which is okay but the winter is coming, but nice and pleasant to start our day, right? Right, yeah, we don't wanna talk about winter and what comes with winter, because if anything, it's still fair season. So even though some of our seasons are starting to wrap up, it's not going to be the case at the Fulton County Fair. Temperatures today into the upper 70s, it'll be dry, it'll be warm, and you may even notice a light breeze when you're walking around the fairgrounds. Our temperatures as you step out this morning are sitting into the mid 60s now, the sun doing the trick to warm us up. We did have some 50 through southeast Michigan and even towards Wauseon, but you can see those are gone. So now we're beginning that warm up, but we're all going to be looking at the potential for a, for a warm up. The 6 to 10 day temperature outlook has a big bullseye of heat right towards the central portion of the country. Here at home, we're in that orange shading. And for us, that means that we have about a 50% chance of seeing our temperatures above average. So when I look at the temperature trend, you may say, oh, it's just a quick warm up tomorrow. And then we're back into some September weather. But behind it, and even as early as this weekend, we're going to be looking at the 80s again and even mid 80s by next Tuesday. So that heat that we're forecasting, that's it's going to be here and it's going to be here for at least the halfway point of our September. Now we did have a couple of showers in southeast Michigan this morning, but everybody can anticipate dry weather here on our Monday. Even overnight, the forecast is still fairly quiet. The action really doesn't start to pick up till later on Tuesday. So when you head out Tuesday morning, you'll notice that it's dry. You'll notice it's also warmer and a little bit more humid. And that's all uh, just ahead of a cold front that's going to be cruising through tomorrow night. That's it's going to be here around 8, 9, even 10 o'clock that we'll be looking at some showers and storms that will hopefully be gone by Wednesday morning. Highs today will be around 79 degrees and plan on blue skies overhead all day. We'll have partly cloudy conditions as we go to bed. Those lows will bottom out around 58 degrees. And your extended forecast, not only do those temperatures, a little up and down action, but we have a little bit of a rain chance not only on Tuesday, Thursday, and beyond. Not much at all. Plan on plenty of sunshine and another taste of summer coming our way next week. Stephen? Diane, thank